One stop away, got the meal deal for the train. Come on the villa. London Euston only. This train has nine Come on. Carriages. Come on the villa. We've arrived in London Euston. Come on the villa. We're on the train to Brentford. Got a few more stops to go on the underground. I think we've annoyed some fans on the way, singing our songs, but up the villa. Come on the villa, big game today. Right guys, today we're outside the Brentford Community Stadium. Today we're here for Aston Villa versus Brentford. Today's a really big game. The Villa want to extend their lead in the European places. We can go 10 points above Brentford, a team who are challenging us for Europa League. Brentford was in terrible form. I think they've lost four games in a row. We have won five games in a row. So really, Villa should be winning today. Uh, obviously, we've got a lot of ex-Brentford players like Ollie Watkins and Ashley Conza. Brentford got some decent players like Ivan Tony, but I think we're going to win. I think it's going to be 2-1 Villa today. I can see it's conceding, but it's a big, big game. It was Brentford, Brighton, they're all challenging us for the Europa League. So we're on a great run of form. We should be winning. Come on, the Villa. We're going to do it today. Away days are back. Come on, the Villa. Come on. Here we go, the 16,000 seat stadium. Pretty sure the whole end actually holds more than this. We're going in the entrance now. Let's go. Pause the video there. If you guys haven't already, make sure you smash a like on this video. If we can get 500 likes, that'd be very much appreciated because I genuinely spend all of my money going to Villa, home and away, and all I ask for is a like in return. And if you're looking at yourself in the black screen now and you haven't subscribed, what are you doing? Subscribe. I'm trying to get to 15k as soon as possible, people. Anyway, back to the video. Here we go. Score predictions today. 3-0 Villa. 3-0 Villa. 3-0 Villa, yeah. Watkins, 2. Yeah. Wendell, 1. Well, are we going to get Europe, yeah? Yeah. Out the Villa. Out the Villa. Come on, the Villa. Out the Villa. Score prediction. 2-0 Villa. 2-0 Villa. Watkins score twice. Come on, the Villa. Teams are coming out now for kick-off. What a save! Half time, nil nil. Not really much to say, to be honest. It's been a very, very boring first half. I mean, Brentford are obviously in our sort of European bracket area, and we are competing with them, which is all right, I guess. But if we're being honest, Brentford have probably been the better team, if anything. They've had more chances, more possession, more of the ball, and it's just not been the best first half. We haven't really got into the game, apart from an effort from McGinn from about 20 yards away. We haven't really had a shot. So we do this a lot. It was like this against Chelsea and against Tottenham. Pretty crap first half, so in the second half, I'm hoping to play a lot better. Come on, Villa, I've still got faith we can win this game, but it's not been a good first half for us. I need it from Brentford, to be honest, but they have had the better chances. Come on, the Villa, come on. Second half has begun. Got a big second half here. Robert Olsen's come on the pitch, so pretty much any shot ever is going to go in. So we've got a big second half. Come on, the Villa. Score prediction in the second half. Score prediction. Oh, <laughs> He made a save. He actually made a save. Oh. Come on, this is getting a little bit better. 54 minutes in. Okay, maybe not.
1 0 to Brentford. About 60 minutes in, Tony's completely unmarked at the back post and he's put it in for 1 0. It's probably been coming for Brentford to be fair, they've probably been the better team, but that's not a good result for us. 1 0, back post completely unmarked. I mean, 70 minutes in, I don't think Watkins, Ramsey, Louise have really touched the ball to be honest. Going forward, just got really nothing going today. I don't really know what's going on, but it's not great. It needs to improve if we want to get anything in this game. I probably would take a draw to be honest, but. That's got to be it. That's our first chance of the entire game. That's our first real good chance. Oh. To the referee, 1-0. Still not really had a chance in this game. Ollie Watkins is done nothing. I don't know how we've gone for a performance against Newcastle to this. Obviously, there's not been one part of the game where we've dominated or played okay. I'm not sure. It's just not going right for us today. We need a big last five minutes. Come on, Villa. In the fucking pocket! Come on! Come on, Douglas Louise, 1-1, one, one. is Come it deserved? On. I'm not too sure. Come on, no. Come on. Oh, what the... F Ollie Watkins, you've been rubbish today, mate. I'm sorry. No, what is... Oh, and again. Full time. Come on. Did we get a lucky? I'm not too sure. We did not play great in our second half, to be honest. Or in the first half. Going for probably were the better team, but... Under different managers, we probably would have lost that game 2 or 3 nil. So, we'll take what we can get. Great for them, a very good team. They had very good players today. Players like Watkins, Buendia, who are usually our best players, weren't in it today, so it's not too bad. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, smash a like, subscribe. It's a decent point, but it's a little bit disappointing performance. Come on, the Villa.